A Gunderson Health System CEO says if the number of patients who have COVID grows, they will have the expertise to provide that care. Dr. Scott Rathgaber says that expertise, however, comes from other parts of the hospital, affecting their ability to care for other patients with less urgent needs. So we have cut back on some elective procedures that require the hospital in order to keep the capacity current. Um, it, we, our contingencies include further limiting that if we need to draw staff who are experts into the hospital to care for folks. So it's, it's a balance between the people who have um, the COVID infection and the, all of the other people who also have real diseases that have to be cared for. So Dr. Rathgaber says increasing care for one side means a decrease for others because there's only so much capacity. And that means it might slow the care for people who have less urgent problems. And that could mean their condition worsens, requiring more care later. But they have some encouraging news to report. A few weeks ago, Gunderson's chief operating officer told us they were down more than 500 health care staff through illness or quarantine. Dr. Rathgaber says that condition has improved. We have uh, seen those numbers be less than 200 now uh, for a number of uh, days, and that has helped us immensely. So we are making some headway. And I think part of that is this, this somewhat decrease in the community spread that we're seeing right now. It's nowhere near where we would be comfortable, but it is not continuing to go up at a rapid rate. That tells me that people are um, paying attention and they are helping us in the community. And I'm very grateful for that. Dr. Rathgaber, however, still concerned about travel and gathering during the holiday, asking all of us to be careful about the choices we make. And he says we still have an ability to reduce infection rates by wearing a mask, physically distancing, washing hands, and then staying home if you're ill.